Here's why we think interest rates could drop in the future. I know you've heard it before, marry the house, date the rate, buy now, and refi when rates drops. And some of you might be thinking, well, what if they don't drop? And why are people making these claims? Well, here's some information provided to us by our good friends at MBS Highway that help support those claims. Number one is inflation drives mortgage rates. If you look at this chart, there is a direct correlation between the CPI index and the 30-year fixed rate. When inflation rises, interest rates have also increased. And now that we're seeing new highs in inflation, there's no surprise that interest rates have gone up. And number two is the Fed rate hikes and recessions. If you look at this chart, you can see that whenever the Fed has hiked its rates, it has eventually led to recession. And once that we've gone into recession, the federal fund rate has decreased. And we're currently in a period where the Fed is actively raising the federal fund rate and trying to fight inflation. And many are predicting a recession soon, and some argue that it's already begun. And the last slide is mortgage rates and recessions. If you look at this chart, it shows that mortgage rates have decreased in the past six recessions. So if the Fed is taking measures to fight inflation and we are heading towards a recession, there's a high likelihood that rates will also drop as well.